Hoffenheim fighting for survival. They needed three points a day, whereas Ralf Hasenhutl and Ingolstadt, well, their team will be playing next season in the top flight. For Julian Nagelsmann, the youngest ever Bundesliga head coach on the bench here today, it will be a tough time. Hoffenheim needing three points and starting on the back foot. It was Dario Lescano, the Paraguayan, who was beaten by Oliver Bauman after just nine minutes. It was a fast and furious battle between these two, but Ingolstadt, after 17 minutes, took the lead. The goal was scored by Stefan Lex after a brilliant through ball for Marvin Martip. The first assist for the captain in the Bundesliga in 10 years. But the home crowd were right behind their team all the way. And on 37 minutes, they saw this. First of all, the pass through for Andre Kramaric and the shot and goal for Mark Lutz that went all the way. He scored his very first goal against Ingolstadt in the reverse fixture. At half time, it was 1 1 and game on. And that was the case right throughout the full 90 minutes of this great battle between Ingolstadt and Hoffenheim. 52 minutes had been played when this happened. The initial clearance from goalkeeper Newland and Bastian Danker, the referee, pointed to the spot after the foul from Bauer on Kevin Forland. The man to take the penalty was Andre Kramrich, who has already scored from the spot once this season. But the third missed Hoffenheim penalty this term kept the game alive. Good save here from the Norwegian Newland. With time a ticking, four minutes to go. It was sheer delight when Nadjam Amiri scored his fourth of his career in the top flight and won the right secure top flight status for Hoffenheim next season. Hoffenheim 2, Ingolstadt 1, the end result.